Greetings, hello, my name is V. Welcome to my channel. I hope you are well. Hello to you. Uh, <laughs> I'm using the cute and creepy tarot deck review. Probably went up on my channel already. I'll have the link to where you can get this if you want to. So I'm doing a four um, card spread, a cross spread. Um, this is the second time I'm doing it on my channel. So we're going to figure out what your issue is, what you need to avoid, the right path, and where it would lead you. So if you're new here, please subscribe. And if not, thank you for coming back here. Post a lot of fun videos. If you're looking for my pick a card readings, they are in a playlist that have over 100 plus, 140 or something like that. And this daily reading, timeless daily reading, I set this intention for timeless. It will be linked in my, or added to my daily timeless reading playlist, organized differently so that we can keep everything, you know, separate and organized that way. So, all right. So, thank you so much. So, I, I've set the intention before I hit record. Get that out of the way. So, let's see. So, we have what the issue is, what to avoid. Okay. We have the right. Oh my gosh, the last video had this in the, the fourth place. Now it's in the third place. Six of Cups. Okay. And where will the Six of Cups lead you? Oh, okay. Hold on. Where will Six of Cups lead you? Eight of Wands. Eight of Wands? What? Eight of Wands. All right, let's see, let's see. Base, we're going on vision, on intuition. We're going on intuition for these cards. All right, so be, right off the bat, you have six of wands here, okay. All right, so look at that. Okay, the issue is, okay. The issue is here, we have the six of wands here. The issue is that you are either famous you are a leader. You have a lot of people following you. You have some watchers, supporters, people, you know, cheering you on. Look, you're you're this. You're right here. You have your trophy in your hands, and yeah, you're basically. I don't know. You're you're someone who's very. Um, you're like a, a idol or mogul or role model or s just someone who people look up to, basically. So that's your issue right now. What you should avoid is maybe n not letting it get to your head. Not letting it change you. Um, it, you know, for the, for the, for the bad, for the worst. Like, in other words, we have the world here. So maybe you're, okay, you're global, right? Everybody knows about you, the world. You probably have a platform where people are watching you. Maybe you have, you're online, maybe you're on TV, whatever. You have a radio show. And my advice, what to avoid is to let, to let that go to your head. Like, don't forget your humility. Don't forget what you had to go through to get to where you are now. Who the little, who little people you had to step on or get past to get to this world card, right? To get to where you are now. So don't let influences outside influences change you or don't let it get to your head that's what you should avoid because you know like when you're famous people put you on a pedestal or, or you feel like you're being put on a pedestal you feel like you have to live up to the hype or live up to you know how people see you you know and then it, you start to, i don't know like it just changes your your view so stay humble and avoid, because you're being watched. So avoid, be careful with what you say. Your actions speak louder than words. So um, that's what you should avoid. Avoid, avoid having diarrhea of the mouth. <laughs> careful what, you know, with what words you put out there. Because, you know, once it's online, it's online for good, right? 
And then we have the right path, Six of Cups, you helping people, you doing justice, or you, you're you doing work, you're doing great work, you're filling all these cups here. You're doing the right thing, you're helping people. Either receiving or helping. No, I feel like you're helping. Look, these people are like, yes, give us advice, what should I do with my life? And you're like, this is what you should do. I see this is a great, this is a good, uh, this would be a good uh, thing for you to do right now. And we don't know what's going to happen a year from now. But for right now, this is the road you should take. Blah, blah, blah. So you helping people. Look at this cute little dinosaur. Man, this card is beautiful. Helping. Look, he's feeding. He's filling up all these teacups so that someone can have a tea party with them. Right? He has a little cake here. I love this deck. I love this deck. Misha. Your, your work is beautiful, by the way. She's a tattoo artist. She created this deck. It's called the uh, Creepy and Cute and Creepy Tarot. Um, so, and then where would this lead you? This is going to lead you to a lot of, look, eight of wands here. I'm going by my intuition. I'm not going to remember anything that the cards or the traditional tarot says. I'm going to go with what my cross spread wants me to say, with my cards, my intuition wants me to say. So where will this lead you? This will lead you to having a lot of power, fire, power, eight of wands, you having all your little magic wands at your disposal and you being able to pick whatever wands you want to do and make make um make magic happen you know uh let's say someone wants so i don't know someone needs you to um maybe someone needs your your financial advice you're like okay let me dabble into my little wands pencil case oh this one this one's going to help us figure out a good way for you to make money. Let me uh, go look into my little, yep, this little wand right here, this little paintbrush right here. It can be a wand, you know, whatever the case is. It can be you, you whipping out your, your, um, your knowledge from your goodie bag. <laughs> you racking your brain. It can mean you finding a cool book that helped you achieve financial, uh, financial freedom and you ta giving that book to your person. It's like you have all the resources, all the energy, all the creativity tools that you can help people with. And people come to you. So where is this going to lead you? You helping people and then you, people relying on you. Because you're that good. You've succeeded. You've learned. Wow, purples. I did not know that I was going to be dealing with a lot of purples. Because my tablecloth is purple. Um, what I'm saying is I did not realize that... I was going to have a lot of purples in this deck, or else I probably would have chosen a different color. Um, or maybe not. I probably would have chosen, I don't know. I usually go with my orange and feel like it brings happy vibes, but I, I needed to change purple. So it's funny how everything's like, you know, working well together. Beautiful. Hope you like these cards. So, okay, what shall we, what shall we pull? I want to pull, let me pull my, um, my Angels and Ancestors deck. So all my links will be down below to where you can find these decks. And I have deck reviews, deck reviews playlist just for those because I like to keep things in order. All right, let's see, let's see. Awesome possums. Oh, oh, these two. All right. Okay, so the, oh, this is so cool. Medicine Guardian. So you healing, look, you have all the tools you need here. <laughs> no way look at this oh gosh i see synchronicities already their hair kind of looks the same brownish color one second uh, okay so greatness is your right so you're doing th you're doing great things and success success is coming your way because of everything you're pouring into your work and you i think you're doing it because you you, you probably it probably rewards you you know it probably fills your cup Look, it probably fills your cup. Receiving help. So you giving help and you receiving it back in other ways. By making people happy. By knowing that people are living a better life because of you. That's like rewarding. Alright, so thank you for watching. You have a beautiful day. Let me know if this resonates or not. Um, I'm just, I'm just, I'm loving this new spread. And hopefully you are too. We're figuring out what your mission is. What your purpose is. With the, yeah. What we're meant to do here. So thank you for your time.